Oh boy. We always got something going on in the world. We always got something going on in the world. Man. But today's video. Transgender cheerleader choked 70 year old girl kicked out of camp for choking female teammate. Like, what is going on in this world? Like, for real. Like, what is going on in this world? Like, for real. Like, how... First of all, look at all the tattoos that this transgender person has. You know what I'm saying? Whole body tatted up. Like, bruh. This world is crazy, but we about to find out what happened. If you're new to the channel, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And we're going to get straight into it, man. After choking out teammates, teammates was a 17-year-old girl. She choked her because she said that the 17-year-old girl called her a man with a penis. Wow. That's what you are, though. You are a man. gonna get mad at somebody for calling you what you are you're a man you're a man that is that wants to identify as a woman that's really what it is that's crazy man oh man the world we live in now is just so crazy that transgender person he wouldn't have done that to me i'm telling you right now because let's be real like if that same transgender person had got mad if I called him a dude, if we got to get it on, then we're going to have to get it on. I don't care. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I don't really care. You feel me? I mean, I would prefer not to fight a trans dude. You get what I'm saying? But, hey, man, if, if, if you want to put your hands on me and stuff, then we can get it on. You know what I'm saying? We can get it on. I don't got no problem fighting you you know what i'm saying you can still you can still get beat up you feel me don't think because you identify as a woman that you're safe no nah, you ain't safe at least for me Yo, he talking crazy. He's like, watch your back. Mind you, he's saying this to a bunch of females. Like, because this is a dude. Like, come on now. Let's not, let's not entertain this delusion that he's a woman. No, no, no. We're not going to entertain that delusion. Because I'm the type of dude, I like to live in reality. And the reality is that this is a man, right? You could just tell by the voice. You know what I'm saying? There's nothing feminine about his voice at all. You know what I'm saying? This is a man. You know what I'm saying? And even if he did have a feminine voice, it still wouldn't change the fact that he's still a biological man. But the point I'm trying to make is, is that this should not be acceptable at all. This shouldn't be acceptable at all. Like, this stuff is going viral, but, you know, the people on the left, they're going to try to defend the trans do you get what i'm saying all the people in the lbgtq you know what i'm saying they all gonna defend the trans dude they're gonna be like oh well the girl she shouldn't have been talking you know bad about the trans dude 
All of that never would have happened to her if she had just kept her mouth shut. Bro, people talk crap every day. All I'm going to say is, is that this is not acceptable. This is not acceptable at all. This is not acceptable. So Like an adult, bro, these are females, bro. You, Bro, you are a dude talking like this to girls, like high school kids, like cheerleaders, like females. You're a dude, bro. Why are you even talking like that to females, like female cheerleaders, bro? You feel all tough because... You're saying this to a bunch of girls. Oh, whoop de doo You must feel very tough for talking like that to a bunch of girls. Like, I bet you wouldn't be saying that to a bunch of dudes. Yeah, you wouldn't be saying that. You wouldn't be talking like that to a bunch of dudes. You, you, you for sure wouldn't be talking like that to a bunch of dudes. So, if Yo, whoever and it shows a video taken afterwards, shows the transgender woman saying, I barely touched her, but in reality. The trans cheerleader choked the 17-year-old girl. That's crazy. Wow. It says that the trans... Bro, the girl's 17. 17. It's a kid, bro. Like... That's crazy, bro. The woman that's was crazy. booted out of the Ranger College cheerleading camp and given a criminal assault by physical contact citation recently. Wow. Yeah. Wow. That's that's it said that the trans woman allegedly choked out a teammate who she said was making transphobic remarks that she shouldn't be allowed on the team. The trans woman also claimed she was only joking with a seventeen year old girl and that she was targeted because of her race and gender wow the footage from the incident showed teammates telling the transgender woman that she was a man damn which you are damn. you're a wow. man yeah. the father of the 17 year old girl insists there's a footage of the assault this news has been going viral on the internet people have been commenting on this topic People have been saying different things. It's not looking good, guys. It is not looking good, guys. Wow. It's also said that police was called to the scene and the transgender woman was removed from the campus because of this whole situation. Damn, the trans lady posted a video on her Facebook where she can be heard talking to her teammates. She was kind of angry. She also went on to say that she can prove that she was never physically violent with the 17 year. And you see how this dude that's talking in this video, you see how he's entertaining the the trans person? Like he's he's calling her she. 
even though this is not a she, this is a he. You see how he's entertaining the idea? See, that's the difference between me and a lot of other people. I Like, if you're a dude, that, that's what I'm going to call you. If you get offended, then, I mean, I don't care. You know what I'm saying? Like, your feelings don't matter. Your feelings don't matter, bro. Truth does not care about your feelings. And I will continue to say that repeatedly all the time. Truth does not care about your feelings at all. You know what I'm saying? I have dudes that say messed up things about me all the time. You don't see me talking about, oh, I'm going to kill them or I'm, I'm going to beat them up. Like, bro, because at the end of the day, people are going to say what they want to say about you. There's nothing you could do about it. It's a part of life. It's a part of life, man. You just got to be mentally strong enough to just push through it. You know what I'm saying? People are going to say what they want about you. Regardless if it's the truth or not. Like, you get what I'm saying? It is what it is. You feel me? You can't go around choking each and every single person that calls you a man, which you are. You are a man. Like, they're not lying when they say that. But you can't get mad when people don't align with your self-perception of yourself. Like, you can't do that. That's not a healthy way to live life. You know what I'm saying? But... Oh, man. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. 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 During the video that the trans woman made on Facebook, she can be heard say, if anyone has a problem, come and address it to my face like an adult. She oh. can be heard adding that I barely touched the girl. And she said she was only joking. Man. That appears to contradict the Facebook claim made that no physical contact was made. I was about to say. on the other side of the door, female voices could also be heard telling the transgender lady, you're a man, you have a penis, you're a man, you're a man. Damn. 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 Wow. Mm. This is not looking good, guys. You know, with the recent... Yeah, I'm going to end the video right there. But yeah, man. Um, Yeah, when I first saw this video, man, I was just like, bro, this is crazy. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, bro, society has lost it, man. I'm going to keep saying that, too, because it's the truth. Society is losing it right now with everything. This gender ideology stuff, this transgenderism. The, oh, the LBGTQ. Yo, bro, I wouldn't be surprised if, like, five, ten years from now, the LBGTQ, they've damn near taken over everything. Like, I'm talking about literally everything. I mean, it, it seems like that now because if you say anything about the gay people, trans people, you say anything. Like, if you're a famous person that has a lot of clout and you say anything that is disrespectful towards the LBGTQ, you will literally get canceled, you know what I'm saying? And not only that, but it might affect your career. Well, not might. It will most definitely affect your career. You could end up losing everything. Just because you said one thing about a certain type of person. That's crazy. It's unbelievable, man. It's like people are not allowed to have their own opinions anymore. It's sad. But, yeah, man, I just wanted to bring this video for y'all, man. If y'all enjoyed the video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all later, man.